um, I had a recent vocal uh, training session um, uh, just recently uh, with a gentleman who's a, a singer, a vocalist, um, and he decided to come in and uh, uh, work with me on what I call my elite vocal sessions. Now, uh, it's pretty demanding, pretty demanding sort of uh, session that we do, um, and it can run and last uh, for two to three hours, sometimes longer. Um, but uh, he's, he's actually a reasonable singer. He's a reasonable vocalist. Um, he uh, is um, a lot better than what he gives himself credit for. Now, one thing that um, certainly came um, obvious while he was here uh, was the fact that um, he, the self-belief that he has in himself is quite low. Um, and the reason for that is because he's probably on the first or second step of the ladder, or the staircase, whatever you want to use. Um, step 10 is the highest, for instance. So he's probably on about step one, step two. But um, the problem is, the problem is that he's, he's associating with a group um, and looking and focusing on a group that uh, are beneath him, are beneath him. They're not above him. Um, so this is what today's little talk is going to be about. It's about focusing on a, on a, on a group, peer group, um, of people that don't want you to achieve. <laughs> um, they don't want you to be better than the group. They don't want you to stand out as a shining light within their group. Um, now, it's, it's human nature. Uh, I mean, not everyone's like that. Um, but the general population, like the, the general majority of people, um, don't want someone within their group to be above the group. Um, and this, is, this has been a problem for, for him and no doubt a lot, a lot of other people. Um, but certainly what I saw recently was um, it was a massive problem because it's been obviously a problem for 20, 30 years of his life that um, he has been looking at this group of people that um, are saying, yeah, you're an okay singer, you know, or why would you want to go further? Why would you want to um, do more performing around the place? Why would you want to do and be involved in some, some charity concerts or things? No, don't do that, don't do that. You know, constantly giving him the negative, the, the negative. Um, and this is, this is the problem. Um, always no, always negative, always down. You know, so while, while he's looking at this group of people down here, he has his back to, to the, the, the higher rungs on the ladder or the higher steps, the, the people he looks up to, the people he admires, the people he aspires to be like um, in the music industry, which is you know, what, what I'm talking about right now. Um, he's looking at this group of people that aspire to nothing. They don't have higher levels. They, they're not wanting to reach up and go for gold or, or a Grammy <laughs> album or something, you know. They're, they're, they're looking down and he's got his focus on that group um, and the, the, the comments and the negativity and he has his back to success. Um, it's, it's not good. <laughs> You know, and no wonder, no wonder he's sadly wasted 20, 30 years, maybe more of, of his life, not aspiring to better standards of what he is doing and honing his craft. This is his voice, a singer, a vocalist, and um, lifting his standards, lifting his game, putting those people behind him. That's where they need to be, and he needs to be focused up the, the ladder, up the steps of success to number 10. Um, people like the likes of um, Michael Bublé and like Frank Sinatra and uh, some of these guys, you know, um, that's the style of voice that he has. Um, Michael Crawford, people like that, you know, um, the theatre um, artists that, that are at the top of their game. They, they have worked, they have done the hard, hard slog, the hard yards to get up those steps to success. Um, so instead of looking at this group, no, no, it doesn't matter who it is, um, start shifting your mindset. Start looking at the top of that ladder and uh, start making the steps up towards success. 
Um, there's an old saying that goes, if you uh, do what the successful people are doing and you copy them and you watch them and you, you do what they're doing and you implement that into your life, <laughs> um, eventually you will be successful. Bang. That's as simple as that. You, you can't help but not be successful. If you're looking at the masters and what they are doing and you copy their, what they're doing, how they live their day, how, how, they, how they get up early, they're into work, they're, they're achieving, they're, they're setting their standards high and they are hitting the mark. If you do that, um, you, you, you cannot fail. You cannot fail. You cannot go down. You can only go up. So uh, this gentleman now, um, after about a three hour session recently, is now shifting, changing his GPS coordinates, and uh, he's looking for the higher rungs on the ladder, the higher steps. He's taking himself and his standards, he's raising everything to that next level for that, that's where he can be. It's as simple as that. It's not gonna be easy because he's had a, um, quite a few years of mental programming from all of the people around him and uh, the other groups of people and that that he's been associating with that um, are in that that group. Um, so he needs to pull himself away out of that group um, and lift himself up. There's another uh, expression that says, um, you will be the, the equal sum of uh, your five people that, you, that are around you uh, or the group that are around you. Um, you. You cannot aspire, you can aspire to be more, but you, you won't ever get up over and out of the group if you continue to go through that and, li and, and that journey, um, you, you'll just be stuck. So the, the simple thing is, is uh, change your sales, set a new course for higher, better standards and get into it and do some hard work, hard, hard work. Nothing comes easy. If everything, if everything came easy, everyone would be doing it. Um, but uh, we don't hear about the, the years and years of hard work and practice that these successful people put into their lives. We just see them at the top of their game. Successful people, fantastic. That, you know, oh, how did they do that? Well, how do they do it? Here's, here's the answer. Hard work, hard work. It's as simple as that. So get in, enjoy life, set your sails to a different angle, different wind, Put the negative people behind you and just look for the positivity in everything that you do and be successful. So uh, I'm going to go back and work on a few more uh, tracks here, <laughs> doing some recording again today. So uh, thank you very much for listening. And uh, don't forget to check out masteringyouruniverse.com. And may the rest of your life be the best of your life. Till next time. Bye.